Hello friends, in this video lecture, we will discuss about plant breeding for developing resistance to insect pest. As in previous video we already discussed, there may be 20 to 30 percent or sometime even 100 percent crop losses may be because of a number of pathogens like fungus, bacteria and viruses, especially in tropical countries. While the second major threat that occurs for plant and their productivity is by insect and pest. When we discuss about insect resistance in any host plant, this may be mainly because of morphological, biochemical or physiological characteristics. There are a number of examples given in NCRT and here we have to discuss one by one. This is first here, wheat crop which is carrying hairy leaves with solid stem. Such type of wheat plant is carrying resistance against cereal leaf beetle and stem sawfly. Second is cotton plant. So cotton plant with characteristics like hairy leaves and smooth leaves with nectarless condition they have resistance against jacets and ballworm. Third is about maize crop carrying characteristics like high aspartic acid and low nitrogen and sugar content. Such type of maize plant is carrying resistance against stem borer. Here we are discussing only about insect pest. Pests are all the creatures that causes damage to crops. Along with insects, there may be a number of mites, nematodes, molluscans, etc. But here we are discussing only about insect pest resistance. So what are the tricks by which we can easily memorize all the three crops with their respective characteristics and resistance for a particular paste? So first trick for wheat and their characteristics is given here, heat, hairy leaves and solid stem till death of beetles and sawfly. So from wheat we taken out heat here, hairy leaves and solid stem is about the characteristics and this type of wheat plant is carrying resistance against cereal leaf beetles and stem sawfly. Second trick is for cotton and their characteristics is given here, cotton's hairy smooth leaves and nectarless condition is resistance for jacets and ballworm. So cotton here is about cotton, hairy smooth leaves is given here. Next is about nectarless condition and this kind of cotton plant is carrying resistance against jacets and ballworm that are given here. While the third is about maize, so maize with high aspartic acid, low nitrogen and sugar content is resistant for stem borer. So maize is here, high aspartic acid and low nitrogen sugar content is here and resistance is for stem borer. So these are simplified sentences that includes all the crops with their respective characteristics and resistance to pest. So how we can develop insect pest resistance varieties of crop by using plant breeding if we discuss about the methodology this is same as we discuss five steps of plant breeding. Now the second need is about resistant gene. So this resistant gene for the particular pest can be taken from cultivated varieties or their wild relatives. These are three crops which are developed by using plant breeding methodology for a particular type of insect. So first here is brassica crop that also known as rapeseed or mustard, its variety Pusa Gaurav is carrying resistance against aphids. Second crop is flat bean, its variety Pusa Same 2 and Pusa Same 3 is carrying resistance against jacets, aphids and fruit borer. While the third variety that is okra or bhindi, Abel Moscus esculentus, its variety Pusa Savni and Pusa A4 is carrying resistance against soot and fruit borer insects. 
now what is the trick how we can memorize so first trick for best so first trick for brassica and its variety with respective pest is very easy to memorize we already know about blue green algae that is cyanobacteria so we have to use the same here b is for brassica g is for gorav and a is for aphids pusa is common for all these varieties so no need to memorize that one that's why b for brassica g for gorav and a for aphids second trick is about for varieties of flat bean with their insect pest resistance so sentence is fb cleared semester 2 and 3 with jaff broj here fb is a particular person that participated in a particular exam and in that exam semester 2 and 3 was cleared by fb with jaff broj so here fb for flat bean same 2 and same 3 is respectively for pusa same 2 and pusa same 3 while jaf jaff broj here j for jacets a for aphids f for fruit and b for borer while the third is about okra its variety savni and a4 with suit and fruit borer so sentence is okra savni suited fruit borer on a4 seat okra savni here we can consider as a name here first name is okra that is about bindi and second name that is surname we can consider like savni suited is about suit fruit borer is here and a4 is about this variety pusa a4 so by using these three tricks you can easily memorize all the three crop varieties with their specific insect pest resistance all these are very very important